Here in Vancouver, Washington and Clark County, we have some of the best summers in all the nation. If you want to beat the heat and go swimming, you're going to want to check out these swimming holes and watch this video before you go somewhere and go swimming this summer. Here in Vancouver, we have some of the best water all around and I'm going to give you my favorite spots to go check out this summer. Let's get into it. But before I tell you what these swimming holes are, I want you to like and subscribe to this channel because I'm coming out with videos about living in Vancouver, Washington every single week to keep you guys up to date on what's happening here in the gray area of Vancouver and Clark County. Now one of the first places that comes to mind is Molten Falls. This is a really popular summer hangout spot. It is about north of northeast of Battleground. It is not far out it's on the Lewis River. It's amazing, amazing mountain runoff. There is really cool um, big rocks and swimming holes and jumping areas to go safely jump into the water. It can be a little sketchy in some areas. There are people who do get hurt out there every year. So please have caution when you're jumping into this river. But the water feels so good and so crisp and clean on a hot summer day. Molten Falls is a definite checkout spot. The next spot is going to be Battleground Lake. This lake was built by volcanic activity hundreds of thousands of years ago and it is a treat of an area just outside Battleground. There's actually 50 campsites right there so it's a, it's a national state park but it's beautiful. There's a, a trail that goes all around the lake so definitely check that out. Jump into the water. There's some docks. There's some uh, gradual um, swimming and stuff, but it's crystal clear water. Um, just an awesome treat to go during a summer afternoon and go swimming. The next spot's going to be Wintler Park. Wintler is on the Columbia River and there's a small uh, parking lot that is attached to to the park that you can get out with bathrooms and other stuff this park is really small and fills up very fast and it's right by some train tracks so there's no parking right outside the park um, so it can be a little difficult and tight to get into this park but once you're there the beach is amazing it's sandy beaches all right into the columbia river and it's just an awesome place but you have to get there early to secure a spot and the next one that comes to mind is lacamas lake park this is in Camas, just on the other side of 192nd um, between Vancouver and Camas. This park is great all year round. There are multiple trails, miles of trails all around the lake. So you can go fishing, you can go swimming in certain areas and other stuff. It's really cool. There's a big system of a few different lakes all around that area. You can even rent paddle boards or kayaks. Uh, there's a small boat launch. So do people do take their boats or jet skis out on the lake? it is amazing filled with trees all around just a beautiful area that you must check out this summer this one is gonna be my favorite on the list Cottonwood Beach this is out in Washougal this also has um, adequate parking it can be difficult to, to find some parking on really hot days but the beach is huge it's probably one of the biggest um, spots the swimming holes in the area it's all sand through there you do have to uh, take a little trail through through some trees and stuff and there's a lot of cottonwoods out there and that's where the namesake comes from but this is at the Captain William Clark Regional Park this is a must go this summer pack a cooler pack a pop-up to cover you from the sun and just enjoy it out there all day whenever we go some people that i know bring their boats or bring their jet skis and meet us at the beach and we can take them off and on um, from the sand but it's amazing swimming hole out there tons of fun all summer long and when you want a little bit more clean water and you want to be inside, we have two public recreational centers with Marshall Center and Furstenberg. These are both run by the city and they both have swimming pools inside and they have swim lessons that they offer and tons of other stuff. Uh, Marshall is more downtown, really close to Clark College and Furstenberg is on the east side about like Mill Plain and 136. So you can have tons of fun swimming inside 
and you can swim there. They have swimming times all year round, and I'll have those links and those schedules down in the description. Another great spot is Frenchman's. Frenchman's Bar is on the uh, on the west side of Vancouver Lake, and it is on the Columbia River. There is uh, a lot of parking there. I believe you might have to pay for parking, um, but big sandy beaches, tons of barges go by that make some waves on the on the on the Columbia River. But this is on the west side of the Columbia River rather than everything else on the south side of the Columbia River. So it's definitely a little bit different of uh, sand and the water and stuff, but it's a great swimming hole. There is a park there. There is volleyball nets and other activities to do um, on a great summer day. So definitely go check out Frenchman's Bar. And last but not least is gonna be the Washougal River. Now this is as a whole because if you drive up Washougal River Road, there are tons of little pull-offs and little swimming holes all along the river. So this isn't just one swimming hole, there's multitude out there. And this is a lot more rocky, it's a smaller river, it does move a little faster, um, but it is a great place to cool off, bring a cooler, have some drinks and some food, and just hang out. But it is a little more sketchy compared to some other places, and it's definitely not as easy and user-friendly as more of the Frenchmen's and the Cottonwoods um, with the sand and the bigger river. Please go check out all these spots this summer. Vancouver has some of the best swimming holes all around and please like and share this video with somebody who you want to take and go swimming with this summer. And until then, I will see you in the next one.